England was doing the opposite. They mostly ignored black footballers until it became impossible. And despite being belatedly allowed to play, those black England players still face unimaginable levels of racism. In the case of England in the uh, Euros uh, 2021, the finals, the finals in, against Italy, that resulted in a penalty shootout and the three players who missed um, were all, were all three of them were black. And so then English fans, white English fans sort of, you know, went on social media and abused them. I think what that showed was football in that sense was ahead of the society. When Marcus Rashford, Jaden Sancho and Bukayo Saka missed those penalties, they faced racist abuse online. At least 600 reports of online abuse toward black players in England were recorded after that tournament. After, Marcus Rashford, one of the three players who faced that racist abuse, felt the need to downplay it. I feel like they just reacted to how they felt like, and whether it's because it was three black guys or three white guys, that's how they felt. I remember when like Beckham was getting death threats and getting He hit. was one of them, yeah. So it's like, they, it happens, but they just want you to win, like. No, no. that's like, that's like, that's like. Yeah, but, I hear, certain, but I feel like we... this is actor Daniel Kaluuya. He's interrupting Rashford to tell him, no, actually, the racism you faced was not okay, and actually, it was systemic. That's why you get conflicted with supporting England. It just reminds you of being a kid in England. It reminds you of all them times where you're out, everyone, and then someone says something. You're trying to. You're trying to get closer to the identity of being English and, that, and then that happens. So soccer can highlight unresolved colonial histories of European countries, but can it also offer an alternative, more equal and inclusive vision of what the nation could be? It's difficult to say whether football could overcome the problem of Englishness. I mean, that's a lot of weight um, to place on football. Football is, is often like a, a backdrop, a space where these things play out. That's, that's the best thing that football can do. Um, I think the only way you could change English identity if people organize around it and, 